Hello again, I'm Mike Mazzalongo and you're watching the Bible Talk video blog. Today's blog entry is entitled, Who's Your Person? Well, as Christians, we are our brother's keeper, whether we realize it or not. Now, how we care for each other in society, family, or the church is a true measure of our moral health. Of course, there's a higher expectation for us in the church because how we care for each other is not only a measure of our spiritual health, but a, a way of witnessing the sincerity of our faith. Our concern for each other's well-being, therefore, is not based solely on altruism or cultural identity, but rather on the impetus of our faith in an unseen God and a coming Lord. Of course, this talk about the well-being of another has to become a reality in the life of an actual person for it to become more than just a Christian ideal. So to this end, I ask the question, Who's your person? More specifically, what is the name of the person you are concerned about? And what exactly is your concern moving you to do? You see, if you can't actually name a real person and describe what it is that you're doing for them out of faith, in love, then what you're keeping is a theory, not your brother. Remember, no name equals no keeping. No keeping equals no witness and no witness equals no faith. Maybe this year would be a good time to start asking ourselves, who's my person? Well, I'm Mike Mazzalonga, and you've been watching the Bible Talk video blog. We hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.